So welcome back everybody. Today I've got another ship to show you. This one is called the Bolos. It's a destroyer or a missile boat. It's got a bit of an interesting sort of head design on it. Put a bit of a sort of figurehead cambot style, I guess. And uh, it's mainly, the main body of the ship is in the center as you can see there. As I come back, we've got the weapons on each side. We've got two weapons pods facing in all the directions. Um, there's one weapons pod for each color, in fact. And uh, the clock runs around the center down here, so you can get a good view of the clock there. And then the lights go off every time one goes. So every one and a half seconds, I think, we get on a clock that runs for 15. So if I just start this up, start seeing the missiles launch. And they'll launch in all directions, in all the colors. And this guy's got an overdrive engine. Overdrive engine takes it up to about 320. So it's only a small overdrive. But it's enough to keep it at distance outside of the battle. And like I say, we'll just take this for a little fly. You can see it's very, very, very effective. But like I say, it, staying out of the combat area but at the same time delivering an a, a good amount of artillery in. So I'm going to be scaling this one up because like I say, I think it's quite a nice design. And uh, yeah, I'll probably release this ship as well. So this one's the Bolos. Missile deployment platform. There you go, as you can see, these just so many missiles. And yeah. Just wanted to give you a bit of an update. The way it works is just back here we've got a clock running which fires all the computers. The uh, slaves are inside the main and the uh, masters are on the outside in these wingy bits here and here. And um, as you can see they seem to be quite effective at taking out turrets. Got some overheats or at least there's shuttles there, I don't know. Things tend to hit for around 75 per. Well, I've got 10 blocks in each. So that's where we're at with this. Area denial, I guess. So I'm going to spawn in a whole bunch of these. Here they are. These guys should be firing everything. They haven't fired a thing. If they have, I can't see it. So I'm going to turn mine off. It has a one button ax, uh, action, so you just need to push that one button. That'll turn them all off and all on. They're just waddling around, but yeah, at least we get a good view of them, so. Look a little bit like a goose. Never really noticed it until just now. It does look a little bit like a goose. So yeah, uh, basically thanks for watching. I'll get a download link up for you guys. And uh, yeah, have a lot of fun with this one. Remember, all you have to do is push R on the activation block by the core, and that sets off the fireworks. So it's a bit of a display ship, but it can be useful for an anti-turret ship. So there you go. I'll be scaling this one up, and I will see you next time.